Hey there, my name is Wayne DeFrancesco. I'm the owner of the website WayneDeFrancesco.com where I do swing analysis and golf instruction. And I'm standing on an interesting piece of equipment here and I wanted to do a little promo video for it. I think it's a great piece of machinery. I first ran into this down at the PGA show about a year ago and the owner and inventor, Yana Rush, showed me the machine and I thought it was, uh, was wonderful, and I want to show you how it works and go through some of the cool things it does for you. So over the years, I've compiled a fairly good resume as far as playing goes. I've played in uh, nine major championships and I'm a former national club pro champion. And I know that in my analysis and my study of the golf swing, I found that one of the most important factors in the golf swing is the way the lower body moves and the way that controls what the upper body does. So depth of hip movement is super important. And I really know this firsthand because I had a back fusion, two levels in my lower back, way back in the middle 80s. So for 30 years I've struggled with problems in my midsection and I've always had headaches with my hips coming under. So when we talk about what early extension is in a golf swing, it's very ruinous to impact. It's very difficult to hit the ball consistently if you can't at least stay in your posture while you swing. And as I've studied more swings, I've found that actually the best players gain posture during the swing. So this is one of the only machines I've ever seen that actually allows you to practice this and gives you feedback, not only tactile feedback from the pressure that it takes to push the pad back, but also the computer readout will give you numbers that, that either run while you move or it'll save the numbers and tell you how you did going back and coming through. So as I set up to the ball here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk the the pad back so you'll notice how when I bend over and my bottom end goes out the pad will go backwards. Now I'm going to keep my weight forward on my feet a little bit I'm not going to lean back on this thing I'm going to let it push me forward a little bit and what I'm going to do when I go back I'm going to try to move this back but I'm going to do it with my pivot. So as you can see if my head stays out over the ball and my hip goes back this way, my right hip gets deep, I'm going to lower a little bit and you see some of the best players in the world doing this, especially the best one, Tiger Woods. So that's part of the deal. Backswing, push that thing back now, just as important or even more important in the forward swing, I am going to keep it back. And look how much space that allows me for my right arm to get in front of my chest. And of course, as we know, when the right arm gets in front, the hands get forward and I can achieve a much better impact. So let me hit one for you. So at the end of the swing also, you're going to see, I'm going to try to keep this thing back. And that gets me deep into my left heel. And I'm going to save a lot of side bend at the end. So I like to get in here and just work it back and forth to get that feeling. And if I happen to be going up in the back swing, I'll get a red number. And if I go up in the forward swing, the posture pod will tell me that I am not doing it correctly. So this is a great machine for feedback on one of the most important items in the golf swing. Now as an extra added attraction, we have some bands here for training. And this will give some resistance and load on this hip movement. So as you see, I'm going to attach the cord. This has got some nice tension to it. And when I work my self into the backswing, I can feel the pull and then when I drive I'm going to have to really push off extra 
to feel that lateral movement and keep my hips back at the same time. So that's pretty cool. And then if you look at the one on my right knee, any time that I try to shoot my right leg forward like this, I can really feel the pull. So as I go in this way, again, great feel. And then you've got the band connecting on the left side also to accentuate the pulling action there. So another good feature on the posture pattern. So if you've watched my website, you've seen me give lessons using the posture pod. Now I practice with it. I teach tour players, I teach mini tour players, I teach high level amateurs and all sorts of regular everyday players from beginners to all of them who want to improve. And I'm gonna have them on this machine because right down the line it's great for feeling what one of the most important factors in the swing is. So again, go to my website, waynedefrancesco.com, and you will see how the best players keep their hips back deep during the swing and how I use this in my lessons. So take a look at it and uh, think about asking your pro to get one.